I'm Shay, and that's my mom. Hello, I'm Sophie, and that's my daughter. This is gonna be a universal read. We're gonna pull from the Enchanted Dreams. That's this one. I'm gonna use the Crystal Visions and the Oracle. Oracle of the Fairies. We're gonna pull an Oracle card to see. Oh, this is good. Where this is gonna go. What the theme of this throw should be. Oh, wow. Oh. Let's see what we've got here. If it'll fall out, if not, I'll pull one. Let's see what's gonna happen. What's gonna happen? What fairies are gonna show up? It is cancer season. The moon is in Pisces. Yes, happy birthday to all the cancers. Yes. Happy birthday to all the cancers. A bunch of people, I remember doing a live read and I said my birthday was July 1st and a lot of people are like, me too. Lots of cancers out there. Healing. Now is oh. a time for you to give or receive healing. Everyone has a natural ability to heal others. Yes, even you. Oh, I need that big time. Don't know. All that. right. Well, that's an unexpected. Yeah. Interesting. Let's see what's on the bottom. I'm afraid to look. You want to look and see what's on the bottom? Don't tell us. Oh. Is it a good one? Yeah, it's a good one. We'll put it, it out it? there. You want abundance. It? Prepare yourself oh, for incoming abundance. Release any mental blocks you may have. In fairy land and human land, there is enough abundance for everyone. Well, I like that. I want healing and money. <laughs> Who don't? Yeah, <laughs> really. I need this. I really want that. But I really want this too because I really need it. <laughs> All right, let's see where this is These headed. are big old cards, so I'm going to have to do these a different way, y'all. All right. Abundance and oh, healing. Oh, yeah, for real. We've got healing. And this is mental, physical, emotional, spiritual, whatever, okay? So this isn't just just physical. It's healing, but remember when it when you start talking about healing, it's not like you can do one without all of, all of all of it, right? You can't just do emotional healing. You can't just do physical healing. It's all the same, you know. Physical, emotional, mental, spiritual—it's all the oh, same. Oh, the lovers! Ooh, goody! First card out is the lovers. Ooh, lovely. So, we already know what that means. Could mean choices, morals, and ethics, too. Yeah. Especially with healing coming in. Oh, my. Let's see what we've got here. Me. I have to drink First so much one water. Up. I have hiccups all the time now. All right, so there's your hairpin. There's your pope. There's your... your um, Oh my, okay. Square peg and a square peg. The five of wands. All right. Oh, the unknown card. Oh, look at her. I like it. I know Yay. it. Oh, the king of wands. Ooh, so we've got good wands in our table. And the king of swords. All right, so gosh, Sophie, you just go for it. I know it. She's just pulling out all the cards. So a hierophant. And two kings. Yeah. With the lovers and the unknown. Ooh, this is really interesting. <laughs> what? Okay, because you know that the Hierophant is your Pope, right? Yep. Um, the passive is the High Priestess. The active male fire counterpart that goes to the outside world is the Hierophant. So this is the guy who's like, all right, everybody ship shape and shine your shoes and brush your teeth and, you know, wash your face and comb your hair and get do ready. all that. Get ready. Exactly. This is the, this is the four walls and the church and this is how we do things and this is our community standards and next to the lovers. Then we have five wands, 
the unknown, which is interesting, and then two kings. So the two kings are coming back to this outward hierophant energy in the outer world. The kings are like your outer world, uh -huh. big, huge guys in charge of all kinds of stuff. So what's going on here? And look at Healing this. Abundance. The Ten of Cups. We've got some... We've got some interesting... Some major love on the table. Yeah. Some interesting energies. Uh, daddy energies. Big, huge father energies. Mature. Big, huge. Yeah, very mature, very in control father energies. Is that what somebody is needing? Is that what... I mean... This could be a healing too pertaining to like um, like anima, animus, psyche, deep healing through love, through family, through finding your other half, through finding your other half. The eight of pinnacles. Wow. And abundance through like love and family and having all of that. Oh my oh goodness, my the sun. Mine are just throwing. I haven't used this uh, Crystal Visions in a while. Mm -hmm. Look at all of that. Well, you definitely, okay, look, there's the sun, unknown. He, so you definitely have some healing coming your way. Whatever it is that you need healing, and I see that you've been working towards it. I see that you've actually been, you're actively participating in your own healing process. That's what all, like the Hierophant, the Two Kings, the Sun, the Wands. Yeah, I was going to say the Five of Wands. Yeah, there. you're actively involved in your own healing. So you're, you're not just drinking your sorrows away. You're not just sleeping around so that you don't have to think about one person. Your morals and ethics seem to be in a good place, meaning for you. Whatever, you're aligned with what, what you think is right for you is what you're doing. So you're, you're keeping within those boundaries. You're keeping within that. And it's, it's bringing healing. Don't worry. You know your place. You know where you're at is a good place right now. You're on the right road. Yes. You're doing what you need to do yes. in order to uh, get where you want to be. So, and that's the Eight of Pentacles. You just keep going with that. Keep going. The sun's shining. But I love this unknown card. She's kind of wild card here. What's going on oh, with this unknown? Oh, I'm very... The Knight of, Knight of Wands. Wands. We've got some good fire energies for healing. Clearing out old stuff, healing, uh, a nice support system going on here for healing, and abundance, bringing that in on top of it. This is really, ooh, can't wait to see where this goes, because I'm not going anywhere with these cards. <laughs> I know it. <laughs> I'm not fucking going anywhere. Well, just keep going. Let's keep going because I don't want to, I kind of don't want to break the little spell going on here of what's, what's coming out You've of You've put a lot of work in. <coughs> yes, you have. To getting where you are. Yes. Uh, oh, it just, just oh it my just God. didn't happen. Look at this. It's, oh, uh, you, you just, you have to love cards because they don't tell you anything until, well, bam. Ace of Wands. Oh, my. Ace of Wands. <laughs> and Two of Cups. <laughs> oh, my goodness. So, that is a seriously... If you're looking for healing, this is a healing love. This is healing relationships, healing love, healing camaraderie, healing... Um, Two halves bringing together and making a whole. You started out with the lovers and now you have the Ace of Wands and Two. If you want healing, Ace of Wands is one of the cards you want to see on the table. 
This is somebody who is definitely, by keeping to your morals and ethics, whatever that thing is that you, you didn't, you're not out of line. You're not incongruent with yourself. That's a good way to put it. You're not incongruent. You're like, this is how I, I'm healing. I'm going to do this and need. this is what I'm going to do. You've been very You know like, what you need. Yeah, within that framework, you're, you're, you're doing this thing every day. You're like, every day I get up and every day I eat this and every day I take care of my body and every day I take care of my mind and keep my mind up here. You're not going down, like, you're not getting in the gutter with all the hate and fighting and this and that and all of that stuff. You're get, you're away from all of that. So this is somebody who seriously is like, again, we're going with that theme of, like, getting rid of all of that stuff that doesn't serve you. Getting rid of all of that. What does that mean when people say, because it's such a cliche, get rid of whatever doesn't serve you. Well, what doesn't serve you? Drinking too much, staying out too late, uh, whatever the things are, you cut them out because you realized or you just didn't indulge in them in the first place, however that works for you, because you realized in order for me to feel like I'm in control, in order for me to control this, in order for me to be productive, in order for me to stick to my morals and ethics in order for me to not cloud my mind with all of this other junk, 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 junk from uh -huh. the left and junk from the right and junk from the past and junk from the future and this and that. This is somebody who's like, I do things like this because this is how I, I get things done. You didn't let things fall by the wayside. You didn't just let your responsibilities fall by the wayside. No, you're, you're very much. If you're a male, you stood up and you were a man. Yes. If you're a female, you did the same thing. You stood up and took responsibility. I don't know. I think this is life. like, for me, I'm pretty sure we're probably thinking the same thing at this point. Because, you know, that's how we do it. This is the guy. This is yes. the girl. Definitely. It truly is like, the guy is the one who's. Who's really keeping the house and everything together. There's like a... Am I on the right track here? Are you yeah. thinking the same thing? Look at this. The Knight of Swords. The Eight of Wands. Mm. And the Three of Cups. Yeah. There's going to be an... Someone's going to definitely get healing. Meaning someone's going to be healed like... Physically from something that's been ailing them for a while. And and during all of it, your hubby, other half, whatever, just kept everything together. And gave you, like, the most wonderful, safe space to heal yourself. Home. A safe home. Safe haven. A place to rest your head. You weren't worried, even though he didn't even know how he was going to do it. He did it anyway. Even though you didn't know how you were going to do it, how y'all were going to keep the home together and keep each other. and whatever. It worked out. It did. You have a strong other half in this husband, boyfriend, whoever this other half is for you is like super strong. Kept everything together. Kept everything in line and said, no, this is how we're going to do it. We're going to keep going. I don't I don't care. We're going to keep going. We're going to keep doing exactly we what we're doing. We can't stop now. We can't stop now. And that gave you this gracious space where you really did get to heal like mind, body, soul. Whatever was in your body, it was just a reflection of like, Body, soul, mind, spirit, emotions, mental, all of that stuff that was some overwhelming. Of you here, it was something physical. Yes, some very physical. You. It had manifested in something physical that brought you down. A physical illness of mm -hmm. some sort that uh, obviously you're going to come out on the um, receiving on the other end side and you're going to be you're going to be better. Oh yeah, three of cups. This is your culmination card. This means it's done. 
Your healing, you've already received it. Look at that, Eight of Wands, Sun. Yeah. Knight of Swords. Look at that, Knight of Wands, Knight of Swords. Now, normally, if we're in a reading and we get Knight of Wands and Knight of Swords together, we're like, oh, look out. <laughs> When you, get, when you start piling up knights on the table, things start going haywire. And in this reading, fantastic. Especially with that eight of wands right there, with these two knights and that sun. Ace of wands, two of cups. It Y'all are gonna fall more in love oh, definitely. than you were before. The bond is gonna be strong. Super strong. Yeah, look at that. Two of Cups. Oh, yeah. Your With bond that is going to be so strong. Yes. You guys are seriously, y'all are like two halves of the whole, of uh, the same whole. The seven yep. of Cups. Wow. You've got some seriously grown-up, mature, we're not losing what we had. This isn't going to, because so many people go through something like that. They get divorced. They get, they fight, fight, fight. They yeah. divorce. When tragedy hits a family. Oh, look, I've got one. It, uh, six of cups, six of cups. When tragedy hits families a lot, look, so now we're getting all these cups. A lot of times people fall apart. They just cannot rely yeah, on each other. Exactly. When the going gets tough, <laughs> people fall apart. They do not yeah, know how to take it. if you're not up to it, you're going to leave. Yeah, they do not know how to take it. You're going to find a reason and excuse. When the other you're person do gets whatever sick, whatever needs to be done. Or somebody, something terrible happens, an accident or whatever happens, and it throws everything off course. Not all people can deal with. Uh, no, there's not a lot of people at all that can deal with something coming from that, that tower moment. Yeah. Of sickness death, destruction, all of Nowadays, those things that people hit people want to walk away, but this person is not, not going walk to walk away. away. No. So not if you all. are in the middle of healing, and this is resonating with you, you have no fear. Let the fear go. That unknown Truly. card right there that says, I don't know how we're going to do it, you just let it go. Oh, this let way, it go. Way too many. Let it go. Let it go. Let your other the half love is be... there for you. Oh yes, the love has sure. been there for you. The love has never deserted you. Your love has never deserted you. I think you guys are going to come out. Oh my God! Look at that. What is it? Nine of cups. Yeah. Oh wow! Look, seven of cups, six of cups, nine of cups. You're getting your wish. You guys are going to come out even better. Yes. After than you were before. You're gonna have more abundance, more love, more security in your life than you even thought. And that's crazy, because that never happens. When you go through something like this, when someone gets ill, it usually tanks a family. Right. This is a man who stood up and said, no one's taking my family from me. Whether that means you have kids. Possible, yes, maybe. Maybe not. I don't know. It's not set in stone. For this reading, it looks like you do. But even if you don't, and this is resonating with you or someone else that you know, get ready because kids are coming. <laughs> yeah. Because there are kids in here. So if you don't have them, they're coming. But if you do have them, this is a man who stood up and said, no one's taking my family from me. I don't care how hard it gets. I'm going to go every day. I'm going to do the same thing. We're going to get through this step by step by step by step by day by day by day. Yeah. No one's taking my family. We've worked really hard for this. I'm not going backwards. Just because of somebody, somebody got sick. Just because of yeah, whatever and, happened. And I, I definitely see someone had a physical illness yes. here of some sort. But you're going to come through it. You're going to come out on the other side. You're going to be better oh, yeah. for it. Celebrate it like it's already happened because that's what this Three of Cups is. And if it hasn't happened, it is going it to is happen, gonna happen very soon. Oh, yeah. Very, You've got very the sun soon. and the Ace of Wands. And there, uh, whoever this resonates with out there, oh, you... Yeah. Uh, you're wondering, you're wondering, is this ever going to be over? That's that unknown card right there. You're wondering, wondering. are we going to get through this? You are. The card shows. Yeah, of course. Look, you've got the sun. Eight of wands. Nine of wands. Three of cups. 
Look at these knights are taking this and, and moving this situation along how it should be. You have no worries here. Just, if I could put anybody's mind at rest about being sick. Oh my I know gosh, it. So if real. this resonates with you, if this is someone who's been, had a physical oh, illness. Look, Knight of Cups. The cards show. All we can tell you is Knight what the Cups. cards are saying. Knight of Cups. Next to that Nine of Cups, Knight of Cups. So for anyone who's not married, this person who stayed with you, you're going to get married. So oh, yeah. if this was just like your boyfriend, the nine you of know, wands, you guys are going to solidify it. Y'all are going to get and married. And look at this, the devil. Oh, now y'all know I love that card. <laughs> that That's a perfect spot for that right there. Wow. You guys are, I'm serious. You guys are going to have like the most, oh, look, the sun. Double suns on the table. That's mega healing. All right. Double suns. You got the sun You're right gonna here. You're going to be okay. You're, You're going to be, be okay. good. Your body's going to heal. And with it, your relationship is just going to be so strong. The star. Yeah. going to be so strong. You guys afterwards are going to be are going to be so much better than you were even before. Crazy. And for, for those of y'all that aren't married, this guy proved himself. You're going to marry. Y'all yeah. are going to marry for sure. That's what that Knight of Cups is right I there. I see nothing but coming out of a serious, serious sickness. physical illness. Yep. And, and, and being better off than you were than you before, were before you before, got sick. Which is crazy. That is so crazy. So for some excited. of you, that will be marriage. Yes. For some of you, you're already married. It's however it resonates with you. If you're already married, then your marriage is just going to be stronger because of it. If you're not married, you're definitely getting married. This guy proved himself. You have nothing to worry about. Your physical health is going to... You're, you have so many good energies on the table. Yes. Oh, I hope that part is for me because I really need it. Oh. Yes. There there was for Double some of you out me. there, there was a, a dire Double suns on me. physical oh. illness. But Double you're going to come out me. of it. The cards show. And if you're not feeling it already because I think the cards are showing you're wondering, are you ever going to be able to get back up on your own two feet again yes you are and the wow. and i think also it will just be all of a sudden yeah all like, of a sudden bam. you're like uh you go to bed one night and you're thinking oh god i can't do this much longer and you wake up the next morning and you know you're on the road to recovery you just feel it's it. gonna it's gonna be one of those quick Quick transitions. Wow. This is, whoever this is for, I'm so excited for you. Yes, it's Look. very nice. Five of wands, ten of cups. Look at that. So you got double five of wands. That's just fighting off illness is all that is. Yeah. And ten cups. The, look at that big fat rainbow over that big castle and the people. In the, Isn't that pretty? Look at that. This is exact. I mean, ten cups over the rainbow. You will be better, stronger. Your yes. relationship will, will be, be stronger. stronger. Yep. Oh. Your whole family will be stronger. This is really good. Yes, it is. For whoever is. was suffering with whatever, wherever you are in that in that sickness, if you're if you're still in it, and you feel like like she said, you feel like you don't know how you're going to get through this. You're coming out of it really soon. Yeah, and fast. It's going to be like an overnight thing. But don't oh, overdo so it. Oh, so You still have healing to do, but you're going to know that you're oh, on the road to recovery. Good. This is really good for I know. anybody who needed to hear this. I know Because there is so. nothing bad here. There is absolutely no, nothing, nothing. nothing. Nothing bad. This it's is a good, just... strong relationship. You weren't left to fend for yourself. Nope. You're... Mate, your other half, your boyfriend, girlfriend, husband, wife, whatever it is, however it resonates with you, they stayed with you, they saw it through, they didn't give up on the relationship, they didn't give up on you, they didn't give up on what they wanted. Lovely. Not at all. Oh, that's so inspiring. I know it. That is so inspiring. So if this resonates with you, grab it. Count yourself it. lucky. Grab yeah, it. Yeah, exactly. Grab a hold of it and wow. don't let it go. Because you got something that, 
Oh, don't nobody have no more. That's fantastic. Yeah. Wow. The the people who are willing to stick around with you to go through something like this is slowly Few dwindling. Few far between now, Few guys. far between, yeah. yeah. Oh, oh wow. wow. And I'm so happy. Whoever this is, the healing's coming to you, and you just grab it. Yes, just yes. Just grab it. Because One you day. were ill. You were ill. This person was ill. Ooh. So if you've had an illness that's been lingering and kept you in bed. Oh, that's me. I, like I said, I need the double suns on me. Oh, God. You're going you're to come out I'll of take it. This tunic. Your you life know. is going to be Ooh. so much better. Your future is just going to look up. That's fantastic. Everything's going to look up I'm for you. I'm happy for you. I know what it yes. feels like to be sick. <laughs> so, oh, right. yay. If this resonates with you, grab hold of it. Yes, please. Grab hold of this reading and Healing go to you. town with it. Healing and strength and better relationships. You better after than before. That's amazing. I know it. So inspiring. Wow. All right. All right. Please like, subscribe, leave us a comment. And until our next video, may your moons always be full. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.